Brexit means Brexit has become a signature phrase for Theresa May since the referendum. But it wasn't so long ago that she was a part of the Remain camp. The UK Independence Party, which spearheaded the Brexit campaign, was viewed by May and fellow Conservatives as too extreme. Artis Murad Gastiev reports on what's changed since then. UKIP, I mean, it's just a sort of, you know, bunch of uh, fruitcakes and loonies and closet races, mostly. Given how well they're doing at the moment in the polls, do you regret using fruitcake and closet races? Well, there are some pretty, <laughs> pretty odd people. Pretty, okay, there all are right. Pretty okay. odd people. They hated UKIP for their desire for independence. The Tories were largely for staying in the EU. May 2. The potential risk to jobs, the uncertainties for our economy if we were to leave the European Union. Think about the security, because I do believe we are more secure in the EU. Inside the European Union, we have a number of systems that we are members of that help us. Brexit changed that, and the Tories flip-flopped. I'm optimistic about what we can achieve in the future. The best possible deal for the United Kingdom. A brighter future. As a strong country, with control over our borders and over our laws. Or take immigration. Almost overnight, the Tories went from this... Our openness is part of who we are. ...to this. What we need to do is to have proper control of our immigration. We do want to bring net migration down to sustainable levels. Particularly for people on lower incomes, immigration did have an impact on their wages. Flip-flop to the Tories. Predicting them is easy. Just look at the latest trends and expect the Conservatives to go with them. They don't stand for ideals. They stand for what's popular, even if it was the loonies that came up with it. I led the party four years ago in those county council elections in England um, on a manifesto. We're bringing back grammar schools, uh, getting Britain outside the European Union, controlling immigration uh, and helping small businesses. And four years on, uh, the British Prime Minister was running on exactly the same ticket and swept the board. What a show. May and the Conservatives have all but cloned UKIP's feature policies. Brexit and immigration control. They copied from fruitcakes and closet racists. The lady is certainly looking at UKIP to seek to get new ideas and uh, we will keep them coming to her and hopefully she'll copy them. Mrs May has realised the strength of UKIP. That's why she has been actually shadowing everything that we've quoted. Morad Gazdiev. Artie.